side. I love this guy. The following is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds. Here comes the highly explosive Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins can never be called reserved. He rides high on emotions, and more often than not, those emotions propel him to victory. He's locking up with one of the greatest icons of any era. He's going to have to have the greatest performance of his career. One of the most prolific competitors in WWE history. Without question, a man who has exhibited over 25 years of dominance in sports entertainment. And that dominance will continue before our very eyes tonight. And his opponent, representing the authority from British Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds. The game, Triple H! Only three men with double-digit WrestleMania wins, Undertaker, Cena, and this man. Triple H has defeated Booker T, Randy Orton, and Batista at WrestleMania. Yeah, get this, second only to Hulk Hogan in main event show closing WrestleMania matches. Because on this stage is where Triple H is his most cerebral, his most brutal at the showcase of Immortals. Triple H is a true force to be reckoned with inside the ring. His physicality might even be underrated at this point. And we all know about the mental edge held by the cerebral assassin. Well, in every way possible, Triple H is built to compete at the highest level. Here we go, no holds barred. This match is usually only reserved for the most hostile of rivalries. Rage has clouded their vision, and now they're only focused on unadulterated devastation. Let's hope the local medical facility is prepared for the aftermath of this match. Way to steer clear. Ouch! Short clothesline hits its mark. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in a no DQ match. Oh, come on, Cole. It's not about being sadistic. It's about being smart. There's no safety net in a no disqualification match, and that's a big factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. Now we're talking. This sledgehammer might be what decides this match. Versatility from Rollins. Oh, man. To the face. Powerless position to be in right now. Lands face first. And Rollins looked to step behind. Hell humiliating. He's got him down as this 
this it. And he easily stops the ref's count. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. Capitalizes against the game. Single leg drop kick caught him. Boom, what a forearm. Down he goes. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. From the top, you gotta be kidding me. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. Just caught flush. Big time knee rocks his opponent. Drop kick on the mark. It appears the game might have to think of a different plan after that. Yeah, Rollins not allowing himself to be held down. What's he gonna do here? Oh, that hurt. <laughs> Rollins. For a schoolboy. Uh oh. Call super kick. Kick to the gut. Hooked up. DDT. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Bringing out that kendo stick means he is truly willing to go to the extreme. A steel chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. There it is, pedigree. Rollins reminding Triple H just how explosive the King Slayer can be. How humiliating, just kicks to the face. Rollins firmly establishing the upper hand. A vehement onslaught from Rollins, forcing the King of Kings to bow down. Way up high. Oh my God. Catches nothing but air. Strikes with a kick. Oh, it is a great. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Three. No. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Oh, oh perfect kick. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm. Has the arm trapped. Oh, oh. stop right to the hand. Just rubbing salt in the wound now. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. I don't know what his plans are with that table, but it's going to hurt. Returning to the ring now. Look out! Oh, no! Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. What's he open to find down there? Grabbing a battle here without any peanuts. Rollins escaping danger. He can't take any more of this. This is a very dangerous situation now. Ah, oh, took off the uh, the hood of the announce table. Now there go the monitors. Bad intentions in mind here. Come on, Byron, get in front of me. No. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. And now gets tossed into the ring. Oh, strong impact! Drops 
Just a hammer right on the lower back. Oh, target in the arm. This has got to hurt. And Triple H there continues to slowly dismantle his competition. That assault is certainly going to threaten Seth's chances in this one. And Rollins continuing with some more hard offense. Triple H is looking to neutralize his competition as much as possible here. Oh, knee drop. Woo. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Slipped by Rollins. Uh-oh. It's going to... We're going to see it. Curve stop. End of the line for the game. Cover. He's still in this fight. Next level guts. Next level fortitude on display from the game. What? Kick out. What a battle Rollins has waged so far, but he's not finished yet. Taking it outside the ring now. Single leg drop kick caught him. Boom! Into the barricade. Tosses him back in now. Bang! Triple H hooks the arms. This is vintage Hunter Lee here with the pedigree. That's the game changer. Makes the cover. Hangs on by a thread. Rollins staying in this thing. Some could even say he's far too stubborn to have things end like that. And guys, Triple H is in a rare moment of confusion. The game thought he had enough to end this, but his instincts were wrong. And attacking above the shoulder on the top. Here's a cover. Could be it. Smarting the student, the king of kings, vanquishing the king slayer. Triple H standing tall, proving he still has plenty of tricks up his sleeve that Seth Rollins had no idea about. A competitive matchup for sure, but veteran experience came out on top.